In the View tab, you can change the view of the editor window and also set some preferences for each time that you use the editor. Titling enables you to toggle on and off the information shown in the General tab, giving you a bigger view of the waveform or any other information in that main editor tab below. Timing removes the information of the intro ends, mids, hooks and extra times. Start and end shows the trimmings of the actual start and end of the file itself and gives you the ability to trim it. Loops bring up the timing boxes to set the start and end of a loop within the file. We look at loops in a separate video. Onto the preferences, and any change here is set on a per user basis. By default, the media item editor will show a preview waveform of the audio, as you can see in this example. But if you wish to do any physical editing to the file, to the audio itself, you need to go into full edit mode. To do this, click on the open for full editing button above the preview waveform. If you set this option each time the editor opens it, it will automatically go into full edit mode. The other option sets the focus of the window to be the waveform rather than the general and title fields. If this was set the moment it opened and you hit the spacebar, the audio would begin to play. You could use these preferences whilst doing a certain editing job on files on the media wall and then maybe turn them off to return to default.